welcome to another CAD Dimensions Tech Tip. I'm Mindy and today we're going to talk about the Copy Settings Wizard. The Copy Settings Wizard allows you to save your SOLIDWORKS system settings as well as restore them to users, computers, and profiles. This is great when you've upgraded to a new computer, you want to share your settings with a coworker, or you've just reset your SOLIDWORKS registry while troubleshooting and want your customization back. There are three ways to get to your Copy Settings Wizard. The first, if you're in SOLIDWORKS, go up to your Tools, Save, Restore Settings. The next is under the Task pane on your Resources tab. Under SOLIDWORKS Tools, you can choose Copy Settings Wizard. The last is from your Start menu, All Programs, scroll down to your SOLIDWORKS folder, SOLIDWORKS Tools, and then Copy Settings Wizard. If you have SOLIDWORKS open, you'll want to make sure to close it out, or you won't be able to save or restore settings. Now we'll want to save out our settings, so we'll make sure that we choose the Save option. Click Next. Browse to where you want to save your file, and change the name if you would like. Now you have the option of choosing which settings to save. I recommend making sure everything is selected because when you go to restore your settings you'll have an option to choose which settings to restore. Last, we'll click finish. This will just let us know that that registry file has been saved. To restore our settings we're going to open up our copy settings wizard again. So start menu, all programs, SOLIDWORKS folder, SOLIDWORKS Tools, Copy Settings Wizard. We'll select to restore our settings, hit Next. Here we want to browse to that file. So desktop and choose the file. Here you want to choose the version in which your registry file was saved. And below is where you can choose which settings to restore. Once you have made these selections, Click Next, and you'll have to choose the destination of those settings. Most of the time you're going to choose current user, but there is also an option to do one or more computers on a network or a roaming user profile. We'll click Next, and we get to the last option. This is SOLIDWORKS allowing you to create a backup of the current settings that are on your computer. If you would like to do that, check the box next to it. If you don't, click Finish. SOLIDWORKS will remind you that you haven't created that backup and ask you one more time. If you're all set, again click Yes, and it will let you know that the settings have been successfully copied to the current user. Thank you for watching another CAD Dimensions Tech Tip. We hope you join us again next time. Don't forget to check us out on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, and our blog for more great content by clicking on the links in the description below.